Hi guys, welcome back. It's LSP. It's currently the 26th of September 2019. The time is 2.28 p.m. GMT time. Uh, so just a quick overview of Euro JPY. Uh, before I go into it, uh, I will say now, um, I'm actually a little bit irritated, to be honest. Um, obviously, the uh, a lot of you won't know what I'm talking about, but on the Forex Factory thread, my intention is to help people um, and give of my time, um, not to go back and forth, you know, over things that are just misconstrued you know and misunderstood um so <clears throat> I, was, I i will say if i've said anything on the on the thread you know um you know that's getting under people's skin then obviously let me know and i'll try and correct that but at the end of the day i'm giving of my time you know and i'm trying my best you know to to help as many people as i can in terms of explanations you know let's just be clear about something you know you can't expect me to come in and obviously i'll say this first i'm doing this off my own back yeah so nobody asked me to do this i'm doing this off my own back so i can't then moan when people you know give me feedback that's not what I'm talking about. But you can't expect me to sit down and say, right, okay, so, you know, uh, Price did this and this is the reason why, because, and then go through all a massive long history of why I've arrived at being able to do what I do. Because it's about experience, it's about time, it's about reading the markets, it's about losing money, you know, uh, and learning from that and so on. Uh, and, it, you know, it, it's not just, I do a bunch of videos and everybody just knows what to do, you know, it's not the way this works. You know, so regarding this, I'm just going to clear this up right now. <clears throat> and this is what a lot of people simply do not understand. And this really, really angers me Yeah, when, when I talk about these things. When you are reading price, you cannot just say, okay, well, price came up here and I told you guys somewhere within this candle price is going to stop, should stop, you know, and reverse. Okay, which it did. All right. And if we go down to a lower time frame, say the 15 minute chart. Okay. That's the reason why, right there, the small gap. Price came up, it's an imbalance, okay? So it should need to come up there to rebalance and then go lower. So somebody might say, well, why didn't it go higher? Yeah, why didn't it just continue to go higher? Maybe take some liquidity up here or whatever, yeah? Well, we are in a larger term or longer term time frame move lower. The draw on price is down here. So with that in mind, if price is going up when a higher time frame is going down, okay, so high price, you know, the higher time frame weekly is pushing lower. Yeah, price is supposed to be pushing lower. Yeah, at least that's the way that I see it based on everything that price is doing thus far. It's showing me it wants to come down here to 114.85. Why do I believe that? For lots of different reasons. Lots of different reasons. You know, the lower highs, the way price is moving, this huge move there should have, you know, drive, drove, driven price high. I've explained all of this. Yeah. So for a lot of different reasons, I believe price is going to 114.85. So if I believe it's going down there and I understand the time it takes on the weekly chart to go down there. If we get an up move on a lower time frame, OK, but I believe the higher time frame is going lower. This doesn't bother me. This is just a normal rally right in a downtrend. And then price starts to come down, starts to come down. It starts to break some lows, showing me that it wants to, you know, continue going lower. This is confirmation that the higher time frame is 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 in play and is indeed going down towards that 114.85. Until I see something different or something that that changes that, then it's going lower as far as I'm concerned, you know. And I'm doing my best to explain this. And then obviously we get this nice pop here, leaves the liquidity pool open down here at 117.55. Okay. It's just the logical place for it to go. It didn't do that. It starts to run higher. Trap traders long. Rebalances. Reverses. Takes out this. Made a note here. Price goes up. Bang. Bang. Drop. 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 Takes out the liquidity. Okay. That's it. It's not hard. It re really isn't hard to understand. You know. Um, but again. And I'm sorry I'm coming across as, as, as a little bit aggressive in this video. But like I said. Yes, I understand that I, I'm doing this off my own back. Nobody asked me to do this. So I do appreciate feedback and I don't want to get under anybody's skin. And I appreciate that, you know, um, everybody thinks differently. And I also appreciate that when you're reading something, you attach your own emotion to that. So you don't know. When I typed out what I typed out on the forum yesterday before I got the response that I got from the person I got the response from, I was genuinely wanting to know what I was asking, you know, because 
if I got the response that I was looking for, then I would have been able to to get a better understanding. Okay, so he doesn't get this, this and this, or he does get that. So now I can start to adjust the way that I deal with that particular person, the way that I'm talking to that person, you know, uh, and add certain things into the videos to really help push that along, you know, but I, I'm not a mug for anybody. Okay, you know, like I said, yes, I'm doing this off my own back, but please be respectful. You know, if you want feedback, tell me, you know, I give up my time. I answer private emails. I do videos for people privately, you know, and I, I don't do it for any other reason other because I care and I want people to, to, you know, to learn how to trade. So again, you know, forgive me for sounding you know a little bit over the top, but I, I, I felt it's important to get that out. <clears throat> Going forward, uh, I'm going to be adjusting a few things uh, to make sure that this doesn't happen again. Um, uh, obviously, I, I'll, I'll, I guess I'll, I'll have to be a little bit more careful how I write things as well. Uh, but in the end, you know, I have something to offer. It's not the other way around, you know, um, and I'm doing it for nothing. I'm not doing it because I want anything. It's not. This is not about the Patreon thing, the Patreon service that I have. <clears throat> the Patreon service is completely off topic. Yeah, I never... The only reason I posted all of this in the uh, commercial thread was because I know somebody's going to end up uh, viable. Uh, sorry, somebody's going to end up ending up on Patreon, yeah, and then eventually the thread's going to end up getting moved, just like it has with a couple of other people that I'm in contact with on the forum uh, and so on. So I just put it in there to start with, you know, and it's unfortunate because being in the commercial thread means that a lot of people already have ideas before they've even, you know. Um, got into the content you know they just assume that everybody's out to take their money you know that nobody knows what they're talking about that everybody's just there to con people and that's simply not the case i actually probably one of the very few people out there you know um i know there's others obviously but you know a very small handful of people that actually care and give a shit on the forum and do their best to help other people out so like i said you know i'm not really sure um what happened today on the forum but i, I just wanted to get that out going forward on euro uh, like I said, we've come into an area now where I'm going to be expecting a little bit of a, a little bit of a, you know, a, a price um, slowdown, uh, you know, and that's very simple to understand. Price has taken out a liquidity pool here, and it's in an area where it makes sense price would stop. Why? Again, very difficult to go into unless you understand the high time frames. Okay, the stop run that happened here, price has gone through. There's your order flow shift. What is an order flow shift? Very, very simple. Price was going down. Okay. So the flow is is down. Orders are down, 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 down. Short, 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 short. It goes through that level, creates an order flow shift, which means the orders have shifted from selling to buying. That's it. Very, very simple to understand where they are on the charts and how they form. That takes time to understand. Yeah, it takes time. It's not. I, what's the point in me saying, well, there's an order flow shift right here? Do you understand why there's an order flow shift right there? You know, and this is specifically to the person that I'm, I'm, I'm you know, that commented on the thread. It, it, why? What's? I can tell you there's an order flow shift here, but you know, the orders have shifted from going long to going short. Okay, but just pointing it out is not going to help you. But being able to arrive at this, you need to understand what's going off all the way across here. And up and down and all of this, and you can see the orders are shifting, 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 going for that higher time frame, you know, draw on price, which at the time would have been this one here at the time. So again, like I said, you know, I, 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 I hate talking like this, but, I, you know, I do get a little bit irritated when I'm doing my best to try and help and then people just throw it back in my face somehow or misunderstand what I'm trying to do. So again, let's all just take a step back, just get back to business, you know, and, and just crack on, you know. Um, you know, and in terms of going forward, like I said, with Euro... The higher time frame draw is still in play as far as I'm concerned. I do want to see it through 117.35 now nice and convincingly. You know, uh, if we get some support here and it starts to turn and takes out this week's high, uh, things will change and obviously we'll address those um, or address that when the time comes. But for now, four hour looks very, very good. Mapped everything out way before it happened. Um, and I really hope that everybody's learning from this. You know, it's, that's, that's, that's my hope and that's my intention. OK, so again, lastly. Uh, and one more time, uh, forgive me for coming across as arrogant or aggressive. Um, that's not my intention at all. Like I said, I just want to help, you know, uh, and we'll take it from there. All right, guys, see you soon.